Good morning, everyone. I'm trying to get an angle of my new cell phone. Um, this is really just a test recording. I have my three girls here in the toddler bed, and Dyson is in the bouncer. I just wanted to change Ellis Pampers. Uh, Dia and also Jay is asleep. And their pampas are changed, so they're fine. They ate, so they're pretty comfortable. It's just that I need to change Emma's pampas. And Happy New Year to everyone. This is actually my first video for the new year. And um, I've been enjoying this Looney Tone pampas on, on uh, Emma. So I must admit that she's been wearing this pampas for a while. But I'm going to change her out of that and into this pampas. And I think this one is the Toy Story pampas, I think. <coughs> Excuse me, I still have a cough. My cold is fine, it's just a lingering cough, really. Yes, I'm going to change Emma into this pampas. And again, like I said, this is a test recording. So all my babies are waiting on their new sibling. And um, I think his hair is being rooted at this moment. The artist did say that she was about to root. But I hadn't seen any up-to-date pictures. I'm still waiting for those. All right, so I'll rest that aside. And if you all remember, in my opening, no, not opening, in my blanket reveal with Jay, I did mention that I was changing Emma lens to full lens. And I'm still in the process of doing that, so... The artist is also painting full lens. We're seeing that the set came with, well, the first set that I chose, well, it was, you know, it, I was the one who had asked Miss Beverly to paint the full arms of Kimberly. The Real Born by Bountiful Baby. She painted those arms and those arms were too big. I mean, seeing that the arms were listed as... You know, Emma's original listing shows that she was 20 inches. So I assume, seeing that... <coughs> excuse me. The Kimberly was listed as the... 20 inch baby I assume that the arms would have been fine but they were too big they were really too big the Kimberly to me Kimberly arms was bigger than Jay's arm it's that big it was huge so the Kimberly kit I would say is not a newborn size that has to be a three month baby has to be yeah well, this pampas is cute too on Emma, but I will be saving this Looney Tone because I do like the Looney Tones. Yes, yeah, so I hope you all are having a beautiful new year. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, so like I was saying, this is my second attempt on giving Emma full limbs full arms that is I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep these legs but I did ask the artist to paint the legs that came with the kit the, the kit that I chose you know the mix and match kit by Adri Stoey yeah I chose one of those in the full limbs and I asked the artist to paint not only the arms but also the legs and I did that because if the arms is I, I, I have no idea. It's listed as 18 inch for an 18 inch baby, but that, the limb seems to be thick. So if the arms are thick, see Emma has very 
thin limbs very skinny limbs I should say so I might just need to change both arms and legs you know but if I need to then that's why I did request that the artist paint both so in the next I would say maybe two weeks I'll be able to do a reveal of Emma with her new limbs now the reason I chose to go with the full full limbs is because Emma is a three-quarter arm and you know I mean she's very cuddly with it but if I can change it to full limbs I do prefer to change it to full limbs and my new baby boy is three-quarter limbs so that's you know giving me more incentive to change her limbs to full full arms because I do prefer full arms really but the reason why I chose the twin B kit is because even though it's a three-quarter arms the arms are so unique to me like yeah I, I, I understand that the straight hand gives persons problems but I do like that bended arm I can hear that my husband just walked in so I'm gonna cut this video short so that's it everybody just stay tuned and um hopefully i should have a blanket reveal of my new baby boy and also the limbs of emma so thank you all so much have a great day bye bye